Hello, so I bought this Carly adapter and I am not very satisfied. First of all, I have the second adapter here. It's called VPIC and you can use it with a bunch of OBD2 apps. And I will compare this to Carly because they have very similar functions, but there is huge difference in price. VPIC adapter costs around $15 maybe up to $20 and up good OBD2 app that you can use it's called Car Scanner Pro and it costs $5 for a lifetime premium version Carly costs I, I bought Carly for $150 and I thought that was the final price but only later I discovered that this $150 is actually not one-time payment it is yearly subscription and it wasn't very clear on Carly website check it for yourself look this is Carly website here you can choose your car make and country go next now premium package smart mechanic I want that so select here is also a professional upgrade for all brands not just for Toyota I bought this also and now you are there is your total 119 euros and there is little star next to it and if you go down there is star and in very little writing they say that Carly licenses are an annual subscription so you have to keep paying those every year well let's go over their functions and what they can do because really I think the VPIC can do even more so think about it if you want to use Carly for 10 years so I paid 150 for one year so in 10 years I will pay 1500 dollars or euros and for VPIC 10 years 10 years using VPIC will cost me still the same 25 dollars I paid the first time scanning default codes the better OBD2 adapters can scan all control units, not just the engine. Carly does scan all units, but so does the VPIC. So there is no difference there. Next you have live data. They both can read live data only from the engine control unit. But VPIC actually read more live data. And it can display live data as graphs. With Carly you can see only text values. Next you have bidirectional controls. That means you can use OBD2 scanner to turn on components in your car. Like you can open windows, doors, you can turn on engine fan. But neither of these adapters can do this. For VPIC. I was expecting that for price of Carly it definitely should do it. Freeze frame data. You can read freeze frame data with both adapters. This is for the diagnostics. And next you have service functions. Carly offers maybe one or two service function and VPIC does not offer any. But what you can do with VPIC, you can buy the app called Carista. It costs 10 euros per one month. And it has service functions and also it have customizations. So Carly is famous for its coding and you can you can do some coding, you can do some changes with Carly, but so you can with VPIC. VPIC offers less coding options, but again you can just buy Carista, you pay 10 euros for one month, and you can do with the, this VPIC blue adapter, you can do service functions and you can also do customization and Carista does have more customization features than Carly probably for every car that Carista supports except BMW for BMW the Carly have more these functions coding and service but again the Carly it's just so expensive and BMW owners say that they rather use the app called Beamer Link or Beamer Code. I think those are paid only as lifetime subscriptions or they are cheaper. So yes, this is Carly. It's not a bad OBD tool, but 
it should cost way less it is way overpriced and it, it is not wise to buy this because just again this cost 150 euros per one year and for that price you can have something like this think the act too you will pay 150 also for first year and then you continue to pay subscription at 80 euros per year and this does really everything Carly does not have bi-directional controls this have it Carly does not show live data from all control units this does this will show you also live data graphs this have customization ECU coding this tool has this tool has everything you could need for diagnosing and customizing your car and again in if you use it for 10 years Carly will cost 1500 and this will cost maybe 600 dollars so it is cheaper again Carly is probably most expensive Bluetooth OBD2 scanner I ever bought I have maybe five of them but it is definitely not the best one so I would not recommend you to buy it you are better with either this Think the Act 2 if you want something more advanced or just buy the VPG and use it with Carista app and OBD2 scanner app 